This is Yasir Qadi. Inshallah Ta'ala, I'm going to be teaching one of my favorite classes. It's called Light Upon Light. And it deals with the names and attributes of Allah Subhanahu Wa Ta'ala. Have you ever wondered why Allah Subhanahu Wa Ta'ala finishes almost half of the verses in the Quran with His names and attributes? Have you ever wondered why you're reading the Quran and, it, and, and you read, Inna Allah kana ghafoorur rahima, wallahu tawwabur rahim, Inna Allah azizun hakim. So many names, so many attributes of Allah Subhanahu Wa Ta'ala. SubhanAllah, many Muslims, they just gloss over those endings and they don't really think about why Allah is using those names. And also, why those particular names? Why do some verses say, Azizun Hakim, and others say, Ghafoor uh, Rahim, and others say, Samirun Basir? Have you ever wondered why? There must be a relationship, right? Between what's the context and the ending of the verse. Inshallah, we're gonna be discussing this in a lot of detail, laying the foundations of understanding where does this concept come from? How do we know what a name is? What's the difference between a name and an attribute of Allah? Well, what is exactly the difference? And how do we know the difference? All of this is gonna be discussed in detail in our class. Obviously, you're not going to understand all of that because that's too much to pack into one weekend. But the least we can say, inshallah, you'll begin to appreciate some of the mysteries. You'll begin to, to comprehend some of the, 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 the glimpses of the deep and profound meanings of Allah Azza wa Jal's names and attributes. Now, we're not going to be able to cover uh, the actual names and attributes. That's really a lot of material. But what we will cover is the foundations, the premises. And inshallah ta'ala, after this weekend, I guarantee you that the next time you read the Quran, you are going to read it with a different sense of appreciation, of, of majesty, of beauty. You're going to take your time. Those verse endings aren't just going to be zoomed over anymore, but rather you're going to want to look up more about those names and attributes. And inshallah ta'ala, that really is the ultimate purpose of this information. And that is to draw closer to Allah Jalla Jalaluhu. For further information, log on to www.almaghrib.org. I hope to see you all there. Wassalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.